From year to year, month to month, week to week, and day to day, people across the world are obsessed with a phenomenon that is professional wrestling. But why? 101 Reasons to Love Professional Wrestling There are many components of professional wrestling that should be both understood and celebrated, in no particular order. Mystery Opponents and Partners Not knowing what's around the corner is always a thrill. It could be an unwrapped gift. It could be a blind date. It could be walking through your yard with your eyes closed. In movies, comic books, and the arts, there have always been stories of a protagonist taking on an unknown foe. However, an organized fight or a sporting event, the fighter, player, or team always goes into the competition knowing who will be on the other side. Professional wrestling takes the unknown magic of the arts and combines it with the organized competition of a big game. This is in the form of mystery opponents and partners. This professional wrestling trope is ultimately about baited anticipation. It's not knowing who the participants of the match will be. A match is set. The wrestler enters the ring. Then said wrestler in the audience all wait. The wonder of who will be the next wrestler introduced is anticipated. Enter the mystery opponent. The piece of storytelling goes back to the roots of modern wrestling. A mystery opponent occurs formally as dictated by the company, or it can happen organically. When an established star, be it champion or not, has a standing open challenge. It's always interesting to see who will accept it. The more recurring storytelling touch point is where the authority figure will have the wrestler face off against someone of their choosing that will be revealed at match time. One of the most historic mystery opponent moments occurred at SummerSlam in 1988. The Ultimate Warrior's entrance blew the roof off the arena as he showed up to quickly defeat the Honky Tonk Man and thus win the Intercontinental Championship. There are some instances where the mystery opponent becomes a regular occurrence. The Royal Rumble will often reveal all of the competitors, but sometimes they hold a few back to allow for speculation. The two biggest examples of this would be John Cena making his surprise comeback or Edge returning from years of an injury-related accident. Then there are surprise debuts in the Royal Rumble, like when AJ Styles made his long-awaited arrival in shocking fashion. All Elite Wrestling has a mystery opponent built into their battle royals as an unknown and unannounced competitor enters as the Joker card. Sometimes there's a lot of hype, but that does not exactly live up to the promotion. This would be the case with the Black Scorpion from WCW in the early 90s. It's hit or miss in result, but the execution of the concept is where the magic is. A mystery partner is exactly how it sounds. This variation of the idea involves a match that has one tag team taking on one person who has not revealed who would be their partner. At the Survivor Series in 1990, Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase introduced his mystery partner in The Undertaker. Owen Hart would declare he had a mystery partner for his tag team title match at WrestleMania 11. This turned out to be Hall of Famer Yokozuna. The New World Order would kick off with a mystery third man that would be revealed as Hulk Hogan turning heel on his beloved following. We also saw Dude Love debut as the mystery partner to Stone Cold Steve Austin on an Attitude Era episode of Monday Night Raw. The same could be said for Sasha Banks, surprise partner in the debuting from NXT, Bailey. Then there were moments like 1996 where Jimmy Superfly Snuka was a letdown 
and his Survivor Series appearance. Using a mystery partner is also a way of replacing someone who is either hurt or cannot make the show. At No Way Out of Texas in 1998, Shawn Michaels could not participate, so for one night, Degeneration X would team up with Savio Vega. No matter what, the mystery is still there. Fans never really know who is coming out of that curtain. If it is a big surprise, then it makes for a magical moment. If it's a letdown, it's still a moment, regardless of magic. Because whether it be a gasp to the shocker, a sigh of relief, or a groan of disappointment, it's that frozen heartbeat that precedes it that truly matters.